Hi guys. Inz Molila here, and today, I'm going to do a commentary on a commentary on Jay Kaiser's rant on the Loud House. Created by Peter on YT PlayStation and Xbox fan. And I'm portraying as Snowball. Why? It's because he is a cool character from that TV show. And I'm pretty sure this commentary is going to be cringe. Because he has invalid reasons in this commentary. Anyways, let's get started. Greetings, this is Peter on YT PlayStation and Xbox fan, and today's commentary will be on Jay Kaiser's rant on the Loud House. Well your commentary is going to suck. Because you bully Jay Kaiser for calling him Jay Jay Kaiser the Jet Plane. Also, you claimed that you hate Jay Jay the Jet Plane, yet you called him Jay Jay Kaiser the Jet Plane, making you a massive hypocrite. This rant is going to suck, because it has a lot of invalid reasons to hate the Loud House. Well I can't argue with you on that one. He said that he had invalid reasons to hate that show. He says that the characters will eat mop. They can't go to the real world just to do that. But you still suck. Anyways, grab your popcorn, soda, candy bars, turn on your speakers, take a seat, sit back and relax, and enjoy. What's wrong? You scared to die a commentary on it? That Jay Kaiser's got to one day to die a commentary on it. That's what I thought. Hey guys. Jay here. And I have another rant to share. This one is on the Loud House. Woo! Nobody gives a shit! But if you hate this show, I can handle your opinion as long as you can handle mine. You're such a hypocrite! Hypocrite much, because you said that you handle opinions, yet you bash opinions, you idiot. No, you're the one who is the hypocrite. But if you bash my opinion on that show, I will block you from my channel. Sorry about that. Anyways, enjoy. The Loud House. No. More like the Dumb House. Really? Was that the best insult you got there? Says the one who does go animate style rants. Oh my god. This show sucks. Correction. This show rocks, because it's one of my favorite shows on Nickelodeon, next to SpongeBob SquarePants. I like these shows too. I will tell you reasons why I hate this show. 1. The animation is terrible. Correction. The animation is great. 2. The characters' designs are too disgusting. How are the character designs are disgusting? Can you explain why? He didn't get a chance to explain because he's not prepared at people doing commentaries on this rant. 3. The theme song is not that great. For me, the theme song is catchy. 4. The episodes are bad. Not all the episodes are bad, the episodes that I don't like are. I'm going to skip this part, because he takes too long listing the episodes he hates. Got a problem with that? 5. Some of the episodes have Lincoln getting abused by his 10 sisters, proving that this show is too violent. Carter, 6. When I watched the episode Left in the Dark, I felt so traumatized, as if it looks like the characters will eat me up. Shut the fuck up, no one cares. Know your fucking place, trash. Oh, that's not very nice. He, he can't help it. Besides, they can't go the real world just to eat them up. 7. This show is so popular. Yes it is popular. Got a problem with that? I got a problem with you bullying Jay Kaiser and that's not even a reason. It is popular. Although this show did go downhill at season 5. Huh? Not to mention that this show also has its movie called The Loud House Movie, which came out on Netflix on August 20th, 2021. I saw that movie on the first day it came out on Netflix. And it came out five years after this show premiered on Nickelodeon. Just like the SpongeBob SquarePants movie came out five years after SpongeBob premiered on Nickelodeon. Why the hell is it so popular? 8. Dom's Classical Corner hates that show. Oh my god, who the hell cares? You're only getting that term to avoid criticism. Even though I hate Dom's Classical Corner. 9. This show has too many loud noises in it. It is has loud noises, 
Got a problem with that, huh? Ten. The worst character from this show is Laurie Loud, because she is a huge disgrace to Candice Flynn from Phineas and Ferb. My all-time favorite character next to Tom Cat from Tom and Jerry, Homer Simpson, and Blue the Puppy from Blue's Clues. Tartar sauce. Why Lori Loud is the worst character from the Loud House, all because she's an expert of stupid relationships. Got a problem with that? The worst character in my opinion is Lynn Jr. I used to like her when this show came out. But I started to hate her in early 2020. Huh? Keep in mind that I used to hate Lori Loud, but not anymore. I hated her since 2019, and I started to like her in February 8, 2021. I still hate Candace Flynn, and I like Tom Cat and Homer Simpson, and I'm neutral to Blue from Blue's Clues, only the classic TV series. You only say that to avoid threatening to feed dogs chocolate. 11. The least cringe-worthy character is Lenny, because when this show came out back on the 2nd of May, 2016, I was her age. That's a stupid reason to hate Lenny. Bruh, he clearly does not hate Lenny. 12. This show was created by Chris Savino, who is a criminal. Yeah I know, he did a lot of abusive episodes from this show, even from the Powerpuff Girls, Dexter's Laboratory, Kick Butowski, Suburban Daredevil, and Mickey Mouse TV series from 2013. And yes, he did got fired in 2017 for sexual harassment. And you know who's a criminal the most? You. There's no such thing as criminal uses. If he was a criminal in real life, he would be in jail. Jay Kaiser. 13. Peter on YT keeps praising that show like it's God. Even though I still like Peter on YT. A hypocrite, Dad. A liar and a hypocrite. What the fuck? Jay Kaiser, you stalked me this time. Are you out of your mind? You know that I still hate you for all that shit you've done. And how many times do I have to tell you, Jay? It's my fucking opinion. We have technology. It didn't work. This is all Mr. Krabs' fault. This was before he lost interest on you. He specifically said, I still like some of his users that hate me. Unfortunately Peter, you're not the one of them because I now hate you for making an abysmal community post on me. 14. There was a spin-off called the Casa Grunts, which that spin-off sucks. Uh, <laughs> can you like, shut up? Well it has a spin-off called the Casa Grandes. Got a problem with that, huh? Keep in mind that I now like the Casa Grandes since October 9, 2020. That's not even a reason to hate the Loud House. It's just a fun fact. And 15. This show has terrible music in it. Tartar saw. And how's the music is terrible exactly? So that's all the reasons why this show sucks. You missed the part to say that his reason to hate the Loud House are complete and they're garbage. Do you know who likes this show? Hey Peter Peter animate the jet plane. He takes too long to list the like and hate spot. And drag extra spots. You should have skipped it, for that. I will skip this. So screw the Loud House. No, fuck you. And screw fanboy and chum chum. SpongeBob SquarePants is so many times better than the Loud House. I do like SpongeBob SquarePants, but you still suck. End of rant. Shut the fuck up, no one cares. <laughs> know your fucking place, trash. Well, I don't give a shit about your upcoming rants, so I'm just gonna skip it. At least you skipped this part. Otherwise, I'll skip this for you. Thank God that this rant is over, man. This rant sucks, because he came up with these invalid reasons to hate the Loud House. Agreed that he has invalid reasons to hate the Loud House but you still suck. Anyways, thanks for watching this commentary, remember to like, comment, share, subscribe, click the bell button to turn on the push notifications, and follow me on social media and discord, the links are on the description. Anyways, this is Peter on YT PlayStation and Xbox fan. Peace out. Finally this commentary is over. This commentary sucked. Because he thinks he stalks him, when he's not.
and Peter, if you're watching this, don't comment fuck you. And J. Kaiser, if you're watching this, I'm sorry I said that you have invalid reasons to hate the Loud House. It's just that Dom's random channel has better reasons to hate that show. Then I can handle both of your opinions. Anyways, that was a commentary. Bye.